Shut up and sit down. Ah, I don't like that. Hey, I'm Simon. I'm Josh. No, you're not Josh, you're Batman. And if you enjoy our stupid video, please remember to like, comment, and most of all, subscribe because it really, really helps us out. And if you don't enjoy it, please like, comment, and subscribe because it's just nice. It is just kind of you. Well, for now, we're having a couple of rums and cokes, of mm -hmm. all things. Mine's rum and hers is coke. And um, we are surprising each other with movie trailers that the other person has not yet seen. Is this one a movie trailer or is it going to be something else? Because you keep saying movie trailer <laughs> and then it's not and then it makes me sad. Oh, I know, I'm such a tease. Lies make baby Jesus cry. Oh, sorry. Well, this is not a movie trailer. This is another TV miniseries, I'm afraid, that is coming to HBO in October. And, you know, it's not my kind of normal thing. It's actually a legal drama. However many times have you heard me say, Oh, I would love to watch that legal drama. Once. Once. Just now. That one. Yes, exactly. But it actually really reminds me of something that we liked a lot and I'd completely forgotten about. And the lead actor in it is strong enough that he pretty much carried an entire show for a gazillion series is. So I'm intrigued to see where this one goes. Me too. Who is it? Me three. Let's watch the trailer. Okay. Oh no. 911, what's your emergency? Hello? Not Are gonna be there? anything good. Yeah. that. Dead. I hit somebody, and I left him. I left him there. Don't do that. Oh my God. Don't tell anyone. Not ever. Bad advice. I can do this. I can keep you safe if no one ever hears about it. The boy you hit this morning is Jimmy Baxter's son. the head of the most vicious crime family in the city. Oh, farts. Whoever you are, wherever you are, you will be found. I need a favor. No questions asked. It wasn't a head run. It was a head. There's no other explanation. So if you want a war, I'll give you a war. No, thank you. We go big. We go big once. Or you could go home. Oh. My best friend just threw me in the deep end. I've got this, John. I don't think you have. Oh, I think you might. It might not be. So, you just watched the trailer for Your Honor coming to Showtime in December, starring Brian Cran Stone. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Not enough Jesse Pinkman. But, despite that, it looks really good. And I saw it's by the same people who did um, The Night Of, mm. which was another legal drama that we did enjoy very much. That is the thing to which I was referring earlier. Yeah, it feels very thematically similar to The Night Of, which I thought was a really, really awesome series. I thought you were referring to Breaking Bad. No, no, I don't think it, it feels like when Breaking Bad. When you said Bad. Brian Cranston, I thought Breaking Oh, Bad. no, Br Brian Cranston, I think, carried Breaking Bad for the yeah. entire series. But this reminded me of The Night Of, in mm. terms of the, the feel of the, the series. And, and the fact that it's like a short-run series as well. It's got that same kind of vibe where it's probably going to be really complex and heavy going, but probably wrap up in like six or eight episodes. And I like it that it starts off... He did a hit and run, and you're like, that sucks. His dad's going to protect him, and you're like, that's not a good idea. But then you find out it's a mobster's kid, and you're like, okay, maybe he probably deserved it. And I quite like things like that that have those twists and turns, where, which is the same as Breaking Bad. Like, you, you kind of feel sympathy towards someone that you really shouldn't. Yeah, especially some guy in his uh, Walter Whites. Um, Tighty-whities. And I feel that 
If Roger Moore taught us only one thing in his many, many years as James Bond 007, it's that nothing good ever comes of sneaking around by a funeral procession with a band involved. I mean, at least this one didn't seem to be in New Orleans and maybe have a voodoo guy in a coffin. Mm. But ever since watching Live and Let... No, Live and Let Die? Yeah, I think so, right? Um, I have been creeped out by any funeral procession that has any kind of band in it. It just just gives me the heebie-majeebies. I've got a meme to show you later. You guys know which one I mean. Um, maybe we could insert it in this video. I don't think it's um, possible to insert things into videos, so I, I think I'm safe. I'm going to ask my editor. <laughs> Ah, I don't like no, that. No, it's not scary. Aww. It's funny. It's a funny meme. Okay. Ha 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 That was quite amusing. I did like that. That was a quality slice of meme. <laughs> well. Fine, sarcasmo. <laughs> One day I'll teach you about memes. Yeah, I don't know memes at this point. Um, and may not ever get them. Well, my friends, I I personally really like the look of Your Honor coming to Showtime in December. I also like the look of Your Honor. Yes, my honor is quite honorable, as is the quite. honorable Brian Cran Stone. So we're going to wait, as usual, with our breath very much baited mm. for this show, uh, because it looks great. And we will see you, my friends on the next Drunk Trailer Ambush. Yes. Peace out, nerds. Bye. Shut up and sit down.